So what is a running fix? A running fix is a navigational method for coastal sailing that involves the use of an estimated position along with bearings taken off of charted objects. Take a look at this plotted example that was done on a recent coastal passage as we were passing Portland on the south coast of the UK. The yacht was on passage from east to west. We'll do a walkthrough of the steps required in order to complete the running fix. Once you've identified an object on the land that you can also identify on the chart, the first thing to do is plot a bearing to that object, bearing line A. This bearing line will be taken with a magnetic hand bearing compass more than likely. Remember that you have to change that magnetic heading to a true heading in order to be able to plot it on the chart. Then make a note of the time and carry on on a known heading for a predetermined amount of time such as half an hour or an hour. And after that amount of time, plot the second bearing, bearing line B. Bearing line B also has to be plotted on the chart in true. Also, the second bearing, bearing line B, does not have to be off the same object. It just needs to be off of another object that you can recognise on the chart. The math still works. Using the information you have, the time travelled, and your heading, plot an estimated position from anywhere on bearing line A. It doesn't matter where on this line you start from. If you can't remember how to do an estimated position, take a look at our video that explains how to do it. Once we've plotted our estimated position, we're going to make a parallel line of bearing line A, or the first bearing, and we're going to draw that so that it intersects the end of the tidal vector. This is the transposed position line and it's labelled as C. If you're in an area that doesn't have any tide, the transposed position line will intersect the end of the water track as you won't have put any tide on the end of your EP. The final estimated position of your vessel then is where the transposed position line line C intersects the second bearing line, bearing line B. As always, best practice is to make a note of the time next to the estimated position. That means the next person on watch can see what was happening when you were navigating. A note on the symbols then. Bearings off of objects have an arrow facing away from the charted object that the bearing was taken from. The transposed position line has two double arrow heads at either end of the line. The estimated position water track will have a single chevron or a single arrowhead on the water track and the tidal vector should have three arrows on it. It doesn't in this example because it was quite small. And finally the estimated position is marked as a triangle with a dot in the centre. That's the running fix then. It's a very handy tool in the navigator's toolbox. As always we've written a thorough article and given you a handy free downloadable cheat sheet so that you can take that away and keep that as a reminder on how to do the running fix. The link to that part of the website where you can get the cheat sheet is below in the description. And if you've enjoyed the video and found it useful, it always helps us to please give us a like, maybe leave a comment and please share it with your friends.